Welcome back to Farming Simulator 17 in U.S. Hill. I'm Tenacious Viking, your farmer host. Well, I have been toiling uh, for hours and hours and hours trying to set up my farm for the 2,000 cattle that I wanted to, to put in here. But I, I have been thwarted by a glitch, which is just makes it not worth the effort. I bought a <coughs> fermentation silo. No, I bought a. Uh, uh, I got that too, but I bought a, uh, a mix uh, mixing station and mixed up total mixtration and uh, dumped it into the uh, into the uh, uh, trough you see here. And it didn't credit it as power food. It credited it as silage. And I thought, well, maybe the mixing uh, the mixer doesn't. Uh, uh, doesn't work in this map. So I sold it, bought a Silo King, should be safe, right? Mixed up uh, some total mixturation and dumped it in and it called that silage as well. So for some reason, whether it's uh, a glitch in my game or a, uh, a glitch in the map, um, this trough will not take power food. And without that, um, it, it just isn't worth uh, trying to build up to 2,000 cattle. I have 287, and you'll see how much money I make uh, on that in in a, in a minute. I have done some other things. Um, another glitch was that when I dumped, uh, when I cleaned up the the, the trough in front of the trough and dumped it in, it just stayed there. There was a time when the grass. Um, in the trough was so high that the cattle walked up to feed and you couldn't see them. Those two cows there, you wouldn't see them. All you'd see is a pile of grass. So I got myself this here um, conveyor system and backed it up to some of the places where I had been dumping grass, including the trough, and sucked it all up into the trailer. Now when I when I catch it in this in this uh, loading wagon and uh, and back up and load it into the um, <coughs> back up and dump it into the uh, into the trough then it then it gets used up but if i just use the 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 bucket like the blue one over there and dump it in it just builds up and builds up it counts it okay and and keeps track of how much is there but graphically it just shows you this big mound of grass which is really ugly so uh once i got done picking it all up i just leave this here and it automatically cleans this this pen up now this won't work in a lot of maps because the trough is, is is too long but this one will pick up just about everything i see i'm a little too far back to pick up a little bit there uh, i might adjust that if i get time but i have 478 um i still need uh some more straw and some i mean it, it's okay for now but uh but 287 cattle is using a lot i think at least seven of those have been birthed um I'm going to speed up time just a little bit. Um, let's see. What else have I done? Uh, okay, I've been selling a bunch of this. Oh, in the background, you see some new buildings. Uh, the first building houses will hold uh, uh, straw, hay, grass, silage, total mixturation, and I think several other things as well. Uh, it's a mod, uh, but it's a pretty cool building. Um, I like it a lot. In, behind that is a nice big garage to store some equipment because I have been cleaning up some of the equipment. I'm doing okay on money at the moment, so I'm not going to bring this in and sell it uh, because it uses a lot. Uh, I am, however, going to start harvesting some more stuff. This is soybeans. I just finished some uh, soybeans over there. Price dropped a little bit, so now I'm harvesting uh, sunflowers. and That's kind of what I've done with my map is just uh, strip it with uh, soybeans and sunflowers. Um, and, and then I, I planted some canola, too, because the price went up on that a little bit. I have some corn <coughs> that I've been saving <coughs> right here uh, to, um, to make forage for, uh, for more silage if I need it, but I have quite a bit on hand right now, so uh, I'm, I'm in pretty good shape there. Um, we need lots and lots of grass, and I have a place to store it, so when I get a chance here in a bit, uh, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to uh, cut some grass and 
I put the tether away. There's no use for hay if you can't make uh, power food anyway. I've got hay over there I can pick up if I need it, if I run out of silage or whatever. Uh, but um, this Challenger is uh, costing us quite a bit of money, uh, kind of on the ropes. Uh, but if you recall what I had him doing, uh, he's been plowing. And the whole field is done. The whole big, huge field is plowed. And it's all fertilized as well. Haven't plowed these three, four, five, six little fields, but I don't really need them. Uh, I might, you know, if I could put, I don't know what I'd put down here. Um, I don't know. I, uh, yeah, I could put corn here and, and make some at the biogas plant. I'm getting about 20000 per uh, trailer of silage, but I pretty much have that. You know, with with the uh, fermentation silo, I just really don't need that. So, uh, <clears throat> one thing I do need to do is put some things away. That uh, planter there needs to be put away. I'm trying to put a set at the uh, at the silo farm and another set at the at the cattle farm. <clears throat> so these will be. Uh, unfolded. Oh, it was. Okay. Now, as soon as I cut away, these two are going to stop, but they'll stay down. So, um, I'm just going to mow all this, the rest of this field of grass, and then uh, go behind and windrow it right here, and then come and pick it up as I need it and fill up that, uh, that, uh, building <laughs> with uh, with grass because grass has been the thing I've been the hardest pressed uh, to keep up with for the cattle. I have enough money to buy a few more cattle but I'm not going to. What I One thing I do want to do however is uh, wash the truck. I've been using it for grain for so long that it's really really dirty. <coughs> I'm just really sad that uh, that uh, the game won't take uh, total mixturation and give me 100% productivity on the milk because uh, I, I really wanted to see how much I'd get out of 2,000 cattle, uh, but with only 73%, it's just it's not going to happen, and, and it's just it's just not worth uh, worth pursuing. Um, and I suppose I need to get this out to the field because uh, I got harvest underway again. <clears throat> See, I have a little grass there. I could pick that up. But I don't really care. That uh, little blue tractor has all it can do to keep up with water. Um, I get messed up because I I uh, skipped that cornfield and I can never remember. Oh boy! Well, I'm gonna ooh, I'm gonna have to stop here. Well, I guess I can. I guess I can. I, that I was thinking that green head uh, might be in the way, but. I think I'm fine. Just fine. Okay, this is good. I don't need water right away. I'm ready to forage this when I need to. Picking up some grass here. I can sell that. Since I'm here, I should uh, should run over and show you this building. This is a mod. Uh, I forget what it's called, but it's, uh, it's really cool. You drop off your grain here, and you pick it up here. And this, I'm putting uh, basically planting equipment here, planting and possibly harvesting. I've got uh, one one cultivator, one plow, and a sprayer here. Probably park the trucks in here too if I'm not using them. I just went ahead and plowed this uh, area and uh, and uh, and then uh, cultivated it 
so that I didn't have grass growing out of stuff like I do here. This was a mistake I oopsed uh, on this one. I still have a stack of junk. I think this is hay, silage, and maybe some grass in it too that I was dumping on the ground here and there to test out uh, everything. Um, see if I could get it to uh, to work properly, and, and it never did. So, uh, let's see. I've got. Do I have? A, I don't have a planter parked um, at the at the barn uh, at the cow farm yet, do I? I'm going to start to clean up all this equipment and, and put it away like it's supposed to. Now that I have the, the one extra barn, there's, there's enough space that I really wasn't using much to um, to uh, to store equipment. Um, I have, oh, the other, the other type of planter there. I only have one of those that should go on the cattle farm, too, because, um, well, I guess I'm planting a lot of sunflowers and uh, soybeans so that could be anywhere I actually need another harvester um, oh I don't know if you saw this or not uh, but I ended up selling one of the harvesters because I dropped the header on the trailer it fell over backwards upside down and I can't you can't reset on this map um, because it says there isn't enough room the store to reset. I've reset in the past, but it keeps saying that there's enough room now. So there's another little glitch. Um, and so I, I couldn't reset the header. So I was trying everything I could think of. I drove the harvester up to it and it said it would connect to it. So I thought, well, that'll flip over the header. No, it connected all right, but instead of flipping over the header, it it turned the harvester upside down. So I had an upside down header and an upside down harvester. No way to turn it right side up, so I just ended up selling those. So now I'm down to one harvester, and I really could use a second one. Um, it, would, it would have sped things up quite a lot when I was raising money to buy the cattle. Um, prices, of course, are not that great yet. Uh, they keep fluctuating some, but but I've got you know three different um, cash crops going, so um, I can usually build up a little bit. Uh, oh, I was going to wash this. Shoot, yeah, I need to do that. I don't know, this Challenger might just get sold. I don't really need anything this powerful anymore, I don't think. I don't know, maybe I do. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, I'm losing some money on it. They're spending quite a bit maintaining it, but, uh, you know, I can afford it, I guess. Okay, um... I'm going to mow some grass. Uh, I did mow a little bit to the right here and, and picked it up right away with the uh, with the loading wagon. <coughs> and I think I may have some from before too that I never did pick up. So we should be able to get quite a lot of grass out of this. I uh, like to fill up the, uh, the trough and then fill up the building with it too. I can also put extra straw in there, which would be nice. I did manage to grab some straw from that big field before the uh, plow finished plowing it under. But remember, I have another field uh, up by Mary's farm that has uh, a lot of straw, too. That it's still, most of that is there, so I have quite a lot of straw. Um, and, and it looks like uh, wheat and barley, or barley prices might, uh, might re re regenerate. Um, so... Um, I might be planting some of that, get a little more straw as well. Um, we'll see. I'm not, am I not getting the... Oh, no, it's on. I'm just not getting anything to show up from the front mower for some reason. Why is that, I wonder? Huh. Okay. Yeah, nothing's showing up from the front there. It's weird. It might be because I've basically kind of mown this down before. I'm not getting a lot out of it right now. 
I didn't see as the is the uh, harvester full. I bet it is, huh? I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and keep the mowers on when I turn here, because it because uh, who cares? Um, I'll probably leave some residual grass, but I don't. Know. It's all right. Um, I better go check on that. Pretty sure that's done. Is it blinking yet? Yeah, it is. And it's way at the end. I've been chasing the this harvester from one end to the other. Um, I don't like the way that turns out. I don't remember doing that during, uh, during the wheat harvest. I think it got like one and a half before it got full. All of, all of these now, maybe because I'm waiting till it's uh, super ripe. I'm only getting one round. Uh, one row of straw here from from one end of the field to the other is more than a for uh, than a loader loading wagon full of uh, of straw. I only get part way and it'll be full. Well, it's almost midnight. I want you to see how much I'm getting from 200 and what 87 uh, cattle. Maybe 288 by now, but I'm not going to check till after after midnight. Um, it's a decent sum, I think. Um, you know, to really be able to just live on cattle on the milk uh, proceeds, you'd, you'd have to double it, probably. Um, I'm not sure I'm in a position to do that. Here it comes. Watch up in the upper right corner. Yeah, $105,578. And uh, you'll see that the uh, the upkeep and all those costs that are deducted every day don't uh, don't get anywhere near that. Oh, it's facing this way. Now twelve thousand in vehicle running costs. Uh, the rest, you know, isn't that much. So one hundred five for two hundred and eighty seven cattle. I think uh, at 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 two hundred it was uh, only about what sixty thousand maybe seventy so. But you know, you, times ten, you'd get six hundred thousand a day. That's just pretty good. Not as much as it was in farming simulator fifteen, but not bad. A right, little up, little animal upkeep costs as well. All right, I'm gonna go back to um, to grass for a little bit. I can find the mower back. I had to clean that too. Boy, I got a lot of work to do, don't I? I love that. Beep, 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 beep. So, with all of the glitches and the drawbacks, um, it's just not worth trying to build up a herd of 2,000 cattle. Uh, views for this series haven't been that great anyway. So, this is going to be the last episode from U.S. Hill pains me to say that and I may continue to play it a little bit and see how many cattle I can get in there and how much I can make in a day but um, unless something really dramatic happens uh, in which I might do a short special episode uh, this will be uh, this will be the last of US Hill a map I didn't think I'd like uh, ended up enjoying it looks like US Hill with the glitches and so on with the cattle is better for those who want to grow crops and sell them and make money doing that and buy some ever bigger equipment and have you know six eight harvesters going up the field together um, maybe a multiplayer map so you can get a bunch of your friends together and you know all harvest a, a big field together um, that I think is is its best use uh, using it for uh, for cattle which is the only thing the only livestock you can have you're using it for cattle just isn't a great investment because of the limitations in which you can feed it um, it's a fairly convenient farm to, to feed the cattle, but uh, but it's just it's just not worth it. So um, with uh, with some sadness and some frustration, um, we're going to be saying goodbye to U.S. Hill um, in this episode. Um, thanks for uh, for watching, um, and uh, you know try U.S. Hill yourself. See if you like it. Let me know what you think. Um, can always uh, tweet me about it, tenacious at tenacious Viking. 
And in the meantime, I'll be watching for uh, uh, other series that will that will replace this one. Uh, no farming, sim no additional farming simulator right now. Um, that's just uh, I don't know if it's uh, worn out, it's welcome or what, but it's just not getting the views that uh, that uh, I'd like to see. And uh, so uh, we'll probably be expanding uh, Sim Airport for now. Um, but. Um, Thanks for joining me at uh, at U.S. Hill, and uh, be watching for uh, some of the other series I play. And of course, don't miss Farming Simulator 17 in Goldcrest Valley with Rick 9G and me. We have an awful lot of fun, and we're getting to the point now where we we can do a lot more. Uh, we have some money coming in every time, uh, some cattle and some livestock to take care of, and um, I think we're going to be looking at maybe buying another field or two next and expanding the farm. So that should be. Uh, pretty exciting. Uh, again, thank you so much for watching, for supporting this series and my channel. Welcome new subscribers. Uh, if you haven't heard me welcome you before, now you have. And uh, uh, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, keep an eye on the channel for, uh, for some future games.